Dickeyville, Wisconsin, appears to be an ordinary town. But recently, I was driving through and saw something unusual near the Catholic Church and stopped to investigate. At first glance, the Holy Ghost Church appears to be truly unremarkable. It was built in 1913. It's got a cemetery out back. It's got a school alongside it. It's got some odd decorations in front, but what lies alongside it is truly stunning. The Holy Ghost Park. The park contains a grotto and several shrines. All of these are the handiwork of a former parish priest who was the parish priest between 1918 and 1931. It's hard to describe the materials that cover the grotto and shrine. They're everything, glass, gems, pottery, porcelain, stalagmites, stalactites, seashells, fossils, minerals, everything you can think of. The grotto and shrine combine a love of religiousness with a love of patriotism. Because what's ever gone wrong by combining the two? Initially, he worked on the grotto, which he began in 1925 and completed in 1929. The priest was helped along by people who sent him materials from all over the place. He was also helped by parish parishioners and some school children who seemed to enjoy being drafted into doing this rather than their schoolwork. Some of the more recent additions are not quite as successful as the originals. The current parish priest rightfully regards the grotto as primarily religious. But when I look at it, what I see is outsider art. In my opinion, if this thing was in LA, it'd be roundly celebrated as a classic example of outsider art. Today, it waits for you in Dickeyville, New York to come discover it.